Hey, it's Fia. For today's video, ituturo ko sa inyo ang aking skincare routine. First thing in the morning, pagkagising ko, maghihilamos na agad ako. Plain top water lang. Hindi mainit, hindi malamig. Yung maligamgam lang. Para maalis yung mga dumi na nakukuha mo sa pillowcase na madalas cause ng pimple sa pisngi. Para rin maalis yung excess products na nilalagay mo sa mukha pag gabi na nasa last part ng video na ito. Kasi hindi naman yun na-absorb ng skin mo and baka mag lang ng clogs sa pores and causing another pimple and then patuyuin mo lang ang mukha mo. Yun lang talaga ang ginagawa ko. Itong susunod kong ipapakita, ginagawa ko na kapag hapon. Usually, pang alis ng makeup or kapag galing sa labas at nausukan para maalis talaga yung mga dumi at hindi ka talaga magka-pimples. Kahit galing lang sa palengke, basta lumabas at pag uwi sa bahay, ito ang gamit kong pandini sa muka. Dapat muna alisin mo yung buhok sa mukha mo so ako nagsuot ako ng headband para walang nakaharang. Dapat malinis din ang kamay mo. Naghugas na ako ng kamay with the soap pero para sure nag-alcohol na din bago hawakan ang muka. Ang unang product ay ang Garnier Micellar Cleansing Water. Para if ever na naka-makeup ka, maaalis nito yung foundation and hindi na magkukos ng pimples na nangyayari kapag matagal na nakastay sa face mo yung makeup. Pero ako, kahit hindi naka-makeup, basta pagbalik ko ng bahay, yan agad ang panlinis ko ng muka for it cleanses and soothes skin and no need to rinse off. So, upward motion dapat and dinadamay ko din ang leeg ko para pantay sila ng muka ko na malinis. Next is one of my favorite product. This is the Bella Micro Peeling Toner na ginamit ko na rin dito sa makeup tutorial ko. Please watch this. I like this because the power of kojic acid and tranexamic acid in one intensive whitening toner with micro peeling technology that gently clears away dead skin without visible peeling and flaking. It exfoliates skin to allow the whitening actives to penetrate deeper, it reduces the appearance of stubborn dark spots, and it illuminates impurities, dirt, and makeup residues. Again, upward motion dapat and be gentle on your skin and use it also sa neck mo. Next is the Eskinol Facial Deep Cleanser. Usually, yung green ang ginagamit ko, pero ito na lang kasi yung available stock nung sa quarantine, kaya pwede na rin. Soap is not enough. Kailangan mo nitong deep facial cleanser para sagad na sagad talaga yung linay sa mukha mo. I love this product kasi ang lamig niya sa mukha. Randomly nga, kahit hindi naman ako lumalabas or kahit hindi naka-makeup, at kapag init na init lang ako at pinapawisan, naglalagay ako ng Eskinol sa mukha, to remove the dirt from my sweat and also to fresh and refresh my face a little bit. That is basically it. My daily skin care routine sa umaga or daytime. Pero medyo nag-iiba yan kapag may pimples ako. Kunwari, it's a bad day for my skin and may pimples ako sa mukha ngayon. Gumagamit ako ng facial wash. I use the St. Ives Blackhead Clearing Green Tea Scrub, especially sa ilong ko na very prone sa blackheads. Pero I find it effective din kapag may pimples ako. I really feel that my skin feels softer and better every time after I use this. Bihira ko lang ito gamitin, hindi on a daily basis. Kapag lang may pimples and kap feel ko na mas bet linisin ang skin ko sa face. After scrubbing, let the product stay for a minute and before mo ito banlawan. Kapag natuyo na ang face mo, para sure na malinis yung pimples, gumagamit uli ako ng mga nabanggit ko kanina. And sinasamahan ko pa ito ng Quick Effects Pimple Eraser. Ibababad mo yan sa part ng face mo na may pimples. It dries the pimple out and based on my experience, 1 to 2 days lang wala na ang pimples ko. Max na ang 3 days kapag gumagamit ka nyan and ang maganda pa dyan, hindi naglilib ng mark sa mukha mo yung pimples pag nawala. Pag na-apply mo na, let it stay the whole day. May technique pa akong ituturo kasi medyo mahal ang pimple eraser na unti lang ang laman. Para makatipid, kumuha ng cotton pad and kumuha lang ng maliit na part nito. Lagyan mo ng Eskinol and kunwari may pimple sa dito sa may pisngi, doon mo ilalagay mo sa mukha mo sa part na yon And let it stay there hanggang matuyo. There you have it. Para ka na rin may pimple eraser cream na mura and it also dries the pimples out too. Kaya mas mabilis mawala ang pimples and wala rin itong marks. Now, proceed naman tayo sa products na ginagamit ko kapag gabi na. Dati, itong Lux Organic Soothing Gel Aloe Vera ang gamit ko. 
Pero nung nag-quarantine, ang ginagamit ko na ay ang Fresh Skin Lab Tomato Glass Skin Soothing Gel Lotion. Nilalagay namin to sa ref at paggabi na ilalagay sa muka. Para sobrang lamig at nakaka-fresh sa muka. Pero hindi ko ito araw-araw ginagamit. Twice a week lang. Kasi kapag araw-araw may tendency na ma-over-moisturize ang muka. Kung may dry skin, meron din naman yung sobra. And may chance din na mag ng pimples kaya minsan at dahan-dahan lang ang paggamit nito. And that's it. Yun na lahat ng ginagamit kong product and ayun na ang aking skincare routine. I just want to remind everyone na all skin tones are beautiful. Morena, Mistisa, Kayumanggi, and Maitim, lahat tayo maganda. Lahat tayo dapat respetuhin ang isa't isa. Remind ko lang na some products may be very effective to me and not to you. Kasi nga, iba-iba naman tayo ng skin. Hanapin mo kung ano yung gumagana sa'yo. Use what works for you. Kahit simpleng tubig lang, malaking help na to clear your skin. Effort and patience lang. But, having pimples, acne, blackheads, whiteheads, and other things does not make you less beautiful. You are beautiful regardless of that, okay? It doesn't define your worth and smile. Be confident on your own skin. Speaking of color, Black Lives Matter. With the latest issue of police brutality in the U.S., it hurts to see that people of color suffer because of them being black. Please end the discrimination. Stop racism. Everyone deserves to live and to have peace. Please sign this petition for you to help and you can also see the link in the description box. There are other ways for you to help and to understand the situation. I have put it in the description box so that you can access and do it on your own. Read the list below. Hindi lang si George Floyd ang nakaka-experience nito. Marami pang cases na hindi na-videohan. Pero this is real and have been struggles of black people even back in history. I have watched RuPaul's Drag Race and every time black gay queens tell their story, I always find myself crying and praying that someday all of this will be gone. The discrimination and, res- and racism, the love and respect will prevail. That's it for my vlog. I hope you enjoy this and if you do give this video a like, share it to your friends and comment your opinions below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Remember to keep the world full of sugar and spice and everything nice.